In recent years, Real Madrid has assembled all the necessary pieces to create one of the best teams in Europe. They have a bright future ahead, full of fighting spirit and promise to help Los Blancos continue to dominate the major tournaments they participate in. Players like Vinicius Jr., Jude Bellingham, and the new signing Kylian Mbappe with their proven class are worthy cornerstones for the present and future of Real Madrid. However, that's not all the Royal Club needs to aim for future success. Faces like Arda Guler, Endrick, and Brahim Diaz, along with many other young players, are also incredibly important. They may not have secured starting spots yet, but they promise to make a significant impact from the bench, something coach Carlo Ancelotti has always valued. Among them, one player the Italian strategist should give more playing time to in the upcoming season is Joan Martinez, a young talent from the Castilla Youth Academy. He is currently touring the U.S. with the club and has made quite an impression in a friendly match against AC Milan. Many fans might still find this name unfamiliar, but the Spanish football gem possesses all the necessary qualities to become a top defender at Real Madrid. If developed correctly, he has the potential to rise at Santiago Bernabeu and become the new Sergio Ramos. Joan Martinez, 16, is considered the golden boy of Real Madrid's youth team at La Fabrica. Joan Martinez possesses incredible speed, tactical sharpness, and the ability to adapt to various systems. He is not afraid to engage in one-on-one -on -one duels to put pressure on opponents, demonstrating focus, dedication, and positivity in every defensive situation. In addition to his relatively good defensive skills, as a modern defender, he also shows confidence when holding the ball, ready to push forward to make through passes or switch the play to the flanks to break the opponent's formation. Under the guidance and mentorship of top stars like Eder Militao and Antonio Rudiger, Joan Martinez will have much to learn at Real Madrid. If he continues to perform well during the pre-season tour, coach Carlo Ancelotti should consider this name. Joan Martinez won the heart of U19 coach Alvaro Arbeloa last season and has also caught the attention of the first team coaching staff, led by Carlo Ancelotti. Reserve team coach Raul Gonzalez will have this young center back in the Castilla squad during the preseason. He has his first chance to play on August Word against Racing de Ferrol, followed by a match against Portuguese side Vizela on August 4th. Raul is giving Joan Martinez the opportunity to step up to replace Raul Asensio, who will be on tour with the first team, and another center back, Jacobo Ramon, who might also be included in Ancelotti's squad for the three friendly matches in the United States. At Real Madrid, Joan Martinez has started to be compared to the legend Sergio Ramos. They look quite similar at the same age. The young star also resembles his predecessor in both physique and playing style both dominating thanks to their impressive stature, nearly 1.90 megs, and technical qualities that allow him to handle the ball neatly. In a squad that doesn't have many options at center back, Ancelotti is taking the opportunity to observe the young defenders. He knows Asensio well, having included him in the squad last season and having him play with the first team in a match against Albacete midweek. And he is closely monitoring the remaining players who can play in that position. Jacobo, who was present at the U19 European Championship, is also in the spotlight and might have a chance to join the first team soon. Joan is one of Real Madrid's most promising players at the moment, born in 2007. The Whites noticed him last year and signed him from Levante after a battle with Betis, Atletico and Barcelona. A bet that seems sure to succeed. There were even reports that he would fly to the US with the first team but Marca confirmed that he will play with the reserve team this summer. The summer schedule with the Euro and Copa America has forced Real Madrid to plan a shorter than usual tour in the United States without the usual training camp in Los Angeles. This year, Madrid will stay on the East Coast to reduce travel time and will play three matches. Real Madrid arrived in the United States on Sunday and will face Milan, Barca and Chelsea in the first week of August. After these matches, they will return to Madrid to spend a week preparing for the first title match of the season, the UEFA Super Cup. 
Joan Martinez had a relatively good 45 minutes against AC Milan in the friendly match in the US. Joan Martinez shared on Instagram, happy for my debut with the first team. Grateful to everyone who has accompanied me on this journey. From now on, let's work and work even harder. Hala Madrid. Martinez was introduced by manager Carlo Ancelotti in the second half of the game, coming on to replace Antonio Rudiger. Despite his young age and the high-pressure environment, he delivered an impressive performance that caught the attention of many. During his 45 minutes on the pitch, Martinez showcased remarkable composure and skill. He completed 24 out of 26 passes, achieving a passing accuracy of over 92%. His ability to execute long passes was equally noteworthy, as he successfully completed four out of five long ball attempts. These statistics highlight his proficiency in distributing the ball and maintaining possession under pressure. Defensively, Martinez was just as effective. He recorded one clearance, one tackle, and one blocked shot, demonstrating his ability to perform crucial defensive actions. During his 45 minutes on the pitch, Martinez showcased remarkable composure and skill. He completed 24 out of 26 passes, achieving a passing accuracy of over 92%. His ability to execute long passes was equally noteworthy, as he successfully completed four out of five long ball attempts. These statistics highlight his proficiency in distributing the ball and maintaining possession under pressure. Defensively, Martinez was just as effective. He recorded one clearance, one tackle, and one blocked shot, demonstrating his ability to perform crucial defensive actions. The 16-year-old center back is having a memorable week, being called up by coach Ancelotti to train with the first team, then traveling with the team to the US tour and making his debut against AC Milan. With David Alaba still recovering from a long-term injury and Nacho Fernandez as well as Rafa Marin having left, the young Spanish talent can fully think about securing a spot in the star-studded squad of the Royal Club next season.